First, the renegades, and now you. Hey, relax. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm a friend. Where's Veronica? Why do you want to know? Because I need her help, and it seems she may need mine as well. Is she okay? She managed to escape. I need to find her. Do you know where she is now? No, but we can try to contact her. Veronica? Veronica? Are you safe? Veronica? <sighs> Shit. Something's not right. Yes. I'm safe. Are you? Oh, I am now. There is someone who needs to speak to you. 
Yeah, Dr. Ryan, I'm Aiden. I know that you're being hunted by the Renegades. Hurry, Aiden. More Renegades may be here any minute. Frank told me you worked for the GRE. I need access to the GRE database in the observatory. I, I have a GRE key. A GRE access key? That's what I've been told. You think you can... Let's meet. I'll be in a small building near the dam, not far from the observatory. Okay, I'll go... Wait, hello? Be careful, Aiden. The place is soaked in chemicals. I will. Thanks for the heads up, Vincenzo. Well, it seems that despite everything, you saved my life. Farewell, Aiden. Farewell. I'm near the dam. Meet me, and then we'll go to the observatory. That's the place you're looking for. But the observatory's soaked in chemicals. Find me in the two-story building squeezed between the dam and the promenade.
It's you. I remember you from the bazaar. You helped the peacekeepers. Yes, but only to get here, really. Ator. He was trying to do something good in Old Villador. But the hatred between the bazaar and PK grew too strong. It became a powder keg. And those renegades, why are they after you? Probably the same reason as you. To access the GRE database. What do you want from it, Aiden? Why are you risking so much? I'm looking for my sister. Your sister was in the GRE? She... No, she was a prisoner. I haven't seen her in 15 years. A prisoner? You mean a test subject? I don't know what I'll find. She's... She's the only family I've got. The only answer to what Waltz has done to us. Waltz? He held us there. Had a hobby of experimenting on kids. Did you know about that? I was only a mid-level doctor, Aiden. I'm sorry. Want to know anything else? Or can we go? Why are you helping me? Are you looking for something in the database as well? Aiden, those vaults contain my organization's biggest secrets. I almost died because I was a part of it. I need to know what they were hiding. What if you don't like what you discover? Nothing ventured, nothing gained. How did a GRE doctor wind up at the bazaar? By not letting anyone know I was a GRE doctor. After the revolution, the GRE were blamed for the disaster. Personnel were rounded up and... executed. People used revenge to relieve the pain. Doesn't matter if it doesn't work. What happened, happened. Now I'm someone else. How are you planning to get us inside the observatory? Look, there's a security tunnel into the complex. It was locked up years ago. Give me the key, Aiden. Are you sure the key is functional? Well, it has been. Maybe the problem is that the building has no electricity. Is there any other way to get in there? It depends how much we're prepared to risk. A lot, if you ask me. Okay. Then come with me. I have something to show you. See those domes? 
Sure, but the place is flooded with chemicals. The GRE had a solution for that. When they created the THV Gen Mod, they had to protect their employees from exposure. But the THV what? The chemicals. They came up with blockers. Shots that would shield their workers for a few minutes from the fumes. Fortunately, I still have two doses. Had a feeling they'd come in handy one day. Well, those must be worth a pretty penny. They are extremely rare. For now, we will need only one. For you. Wait, you're not coming? No, I, I will join you, but... First, I'd like you to restore the power to the building. You see, I... have panic attacks when I'm in tight spaces or in the dark. <laughs> now you probably think I'm a coward. Not at all. I think it took guts to come here. So let's do this. When you get there, first restore the power. Then I'll be able to join you. Hold out your arm. Remember, the shot shields you from the chemicals for a limited time only. Can't I take the other one too? No, not at the same time. This stuff's too strong. Go as fast as you can to the smaller dome, and from there to the higher one. You should find a door leading inside. There. You'll be safe. Then head to the B block. There you should find the building's main circuit breaker. As soon as you turn on the electricity, the security door will unlock, and I can join you by going through the tunnel I showed you. Now go. The blocker is working. <sighs> the blocker is working. Initiated. Veronica, I made it through the chemicals to the first dome. Great. Now just get to the second one. Find a door, a hatch, or whatever leads underground. Right. Veronica, found the entrance. So far, so good. But how do you know this place so well, by the way? I was here just once, long ago. But I have a good memory. That sounds useful. Well, sometimes it's a curse. Really. Veronica, I have a horde of infected here. Shit. I hoped it would be empty by now. 
Well, it isn't. Don't know if I can get through. Use the UV flashlight on your belt. That should keep them at bay. Just don't stop, Aiden.
Erica, I made it. The electricity's on. Great. The security tunnel is open. I'll try to take the elevator down to you. This place was quite the hive. Plenty of infected. But I got rid of them. They were people too, Aiden. They deserve respect. Aiden? What? What's going on? The elevator! It stopped! I see. I think it blew a fuse. I'm checking. Do something. Quick! Please! Don't worry. I'll fix it. Please, don't leave me here. Don't be afraid. I just need a moment. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Sitting on my hands here, Veronica. Try to breathe slowly. Oh, oh. Don't leave me. Just don't leave me here. Shouting won't do anything except attract infected. Yeah, calm down. I won't leave you. You all right? Veronica, I'll meet you by the elevators. Are you all right? See? Told you everything would work out. Just get in. You always been claustrophobic? Seriously? For over ten years. So what happened then? Aiden, for God's sake! Can we not talk about this right now? The, the database. Where is it? Just give me a moment. Below us. Even farther than this? Another six floors down. This is pretty high tech. Before the GRE, this complex was run by the military. They used it to monitor threats, rocket attacks, that sort of thing. That's why they called it the Observatory. Then the virus came, and that was the end. So, what happened here in the end? Well, the GRE lost control of the situation, and it all went to hell. Everything collapsed. 
From what I know, the scientists at first barricaded themselves inside. But soon, conditions in here were as bad as they were in the city. So some of them quietly slipped out. And those who stayed are the ones you got rid of earlier. So the military ran this place before the GRE? Yes. It used to be a Cold War command bunker. Cold War? A period in the last century. Wars back then were fought on a grander scale. It wasn't just about day-to-day -day matters like having enough water, UV lamps, and food scraps. In a way, though, it was just like things are now. People lived every day in constant fear. That's quite the story. They used to call places like this witnesses to history. Dark again. Wait, I'll try and figure something out. If we have electricity here, we could use it to power up the whole floor. <laughs> 